Hey guys, this is Scotty Boy, <coughs> and um, today I'll be giving you another Sony Vegas tutorial. And this time, I thought uh, since I've been doing uh, the mind search and destroy, which is getting into the mind of search and destroy, which is just like how a search and destroy player thinks and how you could better yourself at search and destroy. I thought I might teach you how to make stop frames and how to fasten and slow and the fasten and slow the actual video. Alright, so I got a Rubik's Cube document that is pretty fast, alright? So I'll let you watch it in normal mode. Alright, so this is just normal. That's how fast he is normal, alright? Alright. Now what you want now what you want to do is go to the end of the the frame click control and drag it out to make it slower alright so now this goes for 11 seconds so it'll just go really slow Ready? All right. see how slow it is now if you want to fasten it to make him go real fast just push this all the way down until it gets real small press control again and just go back See, it's, <laughs> that was too fast for Sony to handle, but that is how you do it. And the other way, if you want to make half of it fast and half of it slow, or just keep a bit of it, you click on the middle of the frame, whichever bit you want to use. You can press the arrow keys to make it go frame by frame, as it's doing there. All right, And then you just press S to split the frame. Then you move this frame out. And if you want to make the starting text longer, you press Control and drag it out to make it slower then you click this one to make it faster so you drag it in then you just combine the two frames again and then it will go faster we'll watch it from here see very simple alright now if you wanna uh, say take a snapshot I'll just delete that say you wanna take a snapshot um, of like the middle bit so you'd press S to split it then you click this it's a save snapshot to file alright so you just name it rubik's or R rub I don't know <laughs> that sounds a little dirty but yeah then you save it alright and then it's up here so now you move this frame you put, drag this down here wait a sec that's the wrong file drag that one down there and then move that back in and then wait a sec make this a little small so you don't have to wait too long then do that and then drag this out and then it will just freeze frame this is good if you're like doing <coughs> like a backflip like thing and you want to just show them how to like what like in a frame that you want to do it's pretty simple and it is very useful especially if you're doing like COD stuff and you want to like show a demonstration and talk for a bit while they're watching a frame all right guys hope this helped this is scotty boy from duo intensity and i'm out of here bye guys